Which of the matches you played in do you still think about the most? That one you just showed there with Messi. Rome and Wembley. That's what happened most of the game that I'm chasing him, look. Um, this is probably possibly one of the most embarrassing nights of my life. The thing about him is that he doesn't even, doesn't even come near you. So you actually, me and Vidic stood on the halfway line once at Wembley and looked at each other and just went. If you're a defender, in a game, you want to get near people, or at least get the ball. We didn't have the ball, and I didn't get to put my hands on no one. The problem is, is, when you did get close to him, he was that small and quick. He was going underneath. <laughs> so, I, was like, I was trying to... Normally you go out and hit someone yeah. in the chest, and he was just going underneath it, and I was thinking, this guy, he's a magician. It's 2 0. It's Messi. He's scored again. He's the best player I played against. He was just devastating. And I feel it, we all kind of felt if we played against that Barcelona team without Messi, we probably would have won. Oh, fabulous! Inevitable! In a long, long line of headline goals from the world's greatest footballer. He is a phenomenon.